Hey guys, so today I just want to take a quicker, quicker look here at Cyanogen Mod 9 for your Samsung Galaxy Nexus. Yeah, it's available right now in a nightly bill called Kang. Uh, you can go ahead and check out the developer thread uh, on the XDA developer forum. Uh, but uh, it's uh, the first time I'm using it right now, so I'm just going to turn it off right there. So you can see, you know, how it is first time you boot up because they have changed some things there we go let's boot it up You can see that I changed out the, the boot uh, animation uh, when we fired up. Euroskank. Eurowank. No, Euroskank. Okay, there we go. Pretty quick. Um, As you can see, sometimes in this nightly bill, uh, this latest one uh, says wallet has stopped. And the one I'm using is the latest one from uh, January the 7th, 2012. Uh, okay, weird. Um, sign in. No, 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 no. Don't want to sign in right now. Next, next, next. Boring setup. pretty dark so I'm gonna change that let's see display brightness there we go much better okay so uh, let's take a quick quick uh, look at this new build so clearly what you can see that we have here in the settings are CM settings and trebuchet, 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 no, trebuchet, uh, those are two big things, also when you swipe down from this, you can see that they have quick toggle, obviously you can disable it if you don't like that, but I think that's uh, kind of like useful, uh, but if you go ahead and go down to about phone, you can see that we are running on, yeah, the build date, uh, Saturday, January 7th, uh, baseband version, uh, Sino Game Mode 9 RCO uh, Galaxy Nexus Kang, uh, that's the Sino Game Mode version, Android 4.0.3 Galaxy Nexus. Okay, um, if you go ahead and go back, uh, what else can you quickly see here uh, that they have changed? Wait a sec, doesn't feel, yeah, we don't have Google Apps. Um, so, I mean, the Google Apps comes in a different zip package. I, I did install it after I installed the RM, but maybe you should, you know, do it later or something because I don't have the Google Apps. Okay. Feels really snappy. I think it, it could be even more snappier than what I've used before. I think it is actually uh, that it's more. It's extremely quick. Oh, wait. Okay. They had some lag, but um, yeah, so I will definitely, you know, check this uh, one out a little more. Uh, and, you know, obviously, when we go inside here, if you want to change some Sinogi mode settings, you just go over here and then you swipe uh, automatic backlights, have display, have the input, on screen controls, show search button in navigation. Notification power the width, uh, lock screen, uh, performance, nothing right now, nothing on sound, not on system, not on tablet. Obviously, you know, because it's a nightly one, they don't have that much. But on Trebuchet, you will be able to change like the home screen, uh, a ton of things. If you want to have that search bar, resize widget, scroll wallpaper. Um, Okay, uh, have the drawer, join with apps, blah blah blah, have the dock, nothing, icons, nothing, general, auto-rotate screen, 
um, and it's a trebuchet uh, 0 0.1 uh, right now uh, but seriously it, okay there we go <laughs> so the wall seems to stop uh, sometimes in this uh, nightly one that I'm using right now um, I'm not sure if we can disable that because I mean it's not like I'm gonna use wallet or anything like that so you know let's see uh, where do we have it where do we have that app Google Wallet okay weird oh there we go wallet has stopped can we remove this one I can has delete you oh Okay, shitty app is uh, shitty. Uh, there we go. So, uh, if you want to go ahead and download it, I will leave a link in the description to the thread. If you don't know how to root and unlock your Galaxy Nexus, I also made a video on that. So, you know, be sure to check that out if you want to know how you can do this yourself for your GSM or LTE version of Galaxy Nexus. Now, I don't remember, but I think that this. Uh, our RM uh, firmware from Synogi Mod 9, the Kang one only could be available for GSM users at the moment. Um, so, yeah, well, that sucks, but they're probably fixed for that. So, yeah, see.